All right, time for a new game of Hogs of War because the last one wasn't very good. And this one's mostly just going to be the highlights. Let's go. Well, that was get ready, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that's, I don't think that's gonna get old. I don't think that's gonna get old. I think that's gonna continue to be funny. Yes, sir. What's that? Bang. Yeah, yeah I like... <laughs> this guy's voice matches. I like it. Grenades are the most powerful weapon you get as a grunt. Oh, look at that right on his head. Well, one down. He's really thinking about this one. <laughs> is this like TNT? Is this a TNT? No, this is a sniper rifle. <laughs> a single death can change everything, raw fish. <laughs> right. Yeah, I'm good, Spanky. How are you? Let's go. Like, he just can't do anything. That's my favorite, one of my favorite things about this game. He's got to stand there and watch as I sadistically figure out the best way to kick his ass. All right, well, Bayonet will definitely do him in. Come on. Well, bye-bye. I have no need for my earthly chariots now. Sayonara. I have no idea what he said. He's gonna throw another grenade at the absolute. Oh no, he's putting maximum power behind this one. Can you leave me be, huh? <laughs> Jesus Christ, this guy's useless. 20 seconds. Oh, I've got loads of time. Maybe I should just mock him. Just like, oh, you're scared, are you? Oh, yeah, I wonder if I could get you from here. <laughs> Well, sayonara, asshole. I'm gonna hide behind this tree. I am hit. Ah. Hit? More like shit. Am I right? <laughs> Easiest level completed. <laughs> now, my plan is to make a team entirely out of engineers, which is obviously the greatest plan of all time. Yep, there we go. Two engineers. Next level. Ha ha ha! Alright, it's five versus three, which is, I mean, te technically uh, more unfair than the last level, but one of them is a gunner. Meaning that if you were stupid enough not to bother upgrading your pigs, then uh, you will almost certainly regret doing this level even with five pigs, because that guy will be able to hit you from, like, the other side of the map. Now, the best thing about playing as an engineer is you actually get two goes. Now, you can put down... TNT, I uh, no, uh, a landmine directly underneath that guy. Then go up here. Grab whatever the fuck this is. <laughs> More TNT. Alright, you can put TNT under this guy, which will almost certainly kill him instantly because he's just a grunt and 50 is the amount of damage this thing deals, and also the amount of health he has, so he's pretty much toast. Oh, and he hurt his ass on the way down. Now look at what you going and do. He died of a broken ass. Right, so if I put this as close to him as possible, whilst also angling him into the water, there's a possible chance he may get blown backwards into the water. Possible chance. Then we use a TNT on the other guy, because fuck him. <laughs> oh, he's got a health of two. <laughs> and five. Oh, man, this isn't looking good for these guys. Where are you going? <laughs> what was that for? Take this, your mother. He missed. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, he's concussed. Yes. Not bad. I, uh, I think I'm okay, sir. There we go. Look at that. Another absolute whitewash. Destroyed him. They never stood a chance. 
Foreigners no match for our boys. Squeal, oink, grunt, squeal, grunt, grunt, squeal, grunt, squeal, grunt, squeal, oink, oink, grunt, squeal, oink. Powerful words. And we'll have an engineer, and I think an engineer. <laughs> Start mission. Is he throwing a grenade at his own guy? Yes, sir. Well, that didn't do very well for him, but you know, the war, the war is all about trying to figure out what to do. It's about strategizing, and clearly these guys, these guys don't know strategy, not like I do. PlayStation One AI, you really got to you really got to marvel, and he's throwing a you grenade at a bunker. Unfortunately, it's just not really looking very good for these guys because I'm pretty sure I can end the game on this round <laughs> My strategy is once again absolutely flawless because TNT and dynamite is just the easiest way to win everything <laughs> Well, this is his death sentence And it's gonna wander over to the other guy And pretty much just do the same for him Well rest in peace you bastards. Well, that was, again, very easy. <laughs> just the shed. Just zooms in on the shed. Nice work, shed. Your protective capabilities will be remembered long after we've dismantled you. Alright, so we'll upgrade this guy. <laughs> to engineer. <laughs> and then, and then, uh, then we'll just, uh, we'll just continue. Now, the key thing about this level is, there's a lot of water, and pigs don't swim very well. So, we're going to blow as many of them into the water as possible, and the ones that we cannot blow into the water, we shall aim to blow them up instead. <laughs> Alright, so that should be close enough to set it off, but... Far enough away to... Ooh, <laughs> yeah, maybe... Maybe there. Oh, this guy's dead anyway, fuck it. Doesn't matter whether I put him in the water or not, he's history. See you later, bacon boy. If I do the same thing I did with that one, because that actually sent him quite a distance. So if I just put this sort of like... here... Then we'll just fuck this guy up, the the traditional way. <laughs> oh, farewell, hair dry. Me her dead. Oh, that really knocked him into the water, and the other guy. Wish I could see. Well, one of them died, but the other one made it with seven health. Look at that. Oh, well, it's his go. Oh my god, if this lands in the water just behind them, I'm gonna laugh so hard. Alright. Five on one. I think he's realized the futility of his efforts. Clearly I have my techniques have just been so advanced he's fe he's feeling that like, you know, this is just too hopeless to bother attempting. Yeah, I think we're gonna be okay. I'm not. I think the only damage we've actually taken so far is that one time I dipped a trotter into some water and lost a point of health. Like, do we get an, do we get like an extra extra bonus if we don't take any damage in a war? <laughs> like, I've never I've never been this good before. Obviously, this is just the way to win. <laughs> this is just it. Okay, how much health? That guy got 29 health, but it doesn't matter because we've got TNT anyway. So, like, well, no matter how much health he has, he's pretty much done for. <laughs> well. Bye. Later, loser. That was very, very easy. We are breezing through these. So let's start off by killing this guy. 
I think as an engineer, you get more, you get like a suicide, which I don't think I'm going to bother using for obvious reasons. Because that's not going to help me. Let's just put one this, put that, put that there, that'll be him done. And the key thing is being able to get over to this other island over here, which is really where I think the challenge from this level is going to stem. Because it's just not going to be easy to get over there without taking some sort of damage. That wasn't bad, actually. <laughs> that was pretty good. That was actually pretty good. Well, we don't want them healing themselves, so uh, you can go. Oh, I made it in. Oh, I just made it in. Oh, that was so lucky. Oh, one down. <laughs> Look at that. We killed their orderly. This guy only took, like, a little bit of damage, but... <laughs> but luck luckily, he uh, he actually did more damage to himself there than I think I did. Really? You're going to try a shotgun from that range? Oh, we got him. Fuck. All right. Yes, sir. What's that? Oh... Can't believe you would consider hurting one of my pigs in the middle of a war. You don't realize the can of worms you've just opened. It's all about, you know, people people say it's just blowing stuff up, but it's actually about careful trigonometry. So, like, that guy's got to go over there, and I've just got to hide over here. Now, that's landed him directly in the water. Not that you can see, because we're staring at a shoreline, but he's dead. But is he a good shot? We'll find out. I have no confidence in my abilities. He's got no confidence in his abilities, but is he a good shot? Oh, he is a fucking good shot. Oh no, where are you going? Don't swim towards that shore. The other one's the other side. Me. Hello? Man, idiot. <laughs> well, that'll have to do. Into the into that. <laughs> oh. Man, he, did he land on the other side of the river? Look at that. Really? With a pistol? Fire all phasers. Oh, that's not good. No, 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 no. No, no. Oh, shit. That's bad. Oh, no. No, no I'm not going to make that. Well, he's down. It's only like one versus two now. God, I hope they don't kill him. Oh, there's no way you're gonna get him from there. Come on. Oh fuck, he did. Shit. All right. These guys keep on surprising me. Well. Bye. Nah, he didn't even have time to swim to a shore. <laughs> Too good. <clears throat> He's still <laughs> shooting it. <laughs> this guy's. Guy <laughs> I don't know why he's still shooting it. Like, he's got a bazooka at hand and he's shooting the thing. Using a pistol. That's not going to do anything. Well. Back in the hut. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck with the dynamite. Oh, it landed him in the middle. Oh, oh, he made it, though. Well, now he's on the other shore. We've completely dominated his little island. Oh, he's going in the thing, is he? Oh, I see. This is, uh, hmm. This is going to be a challenge. Because, oh. Oh, no, I can't make it there. I guess the real problem with the sapper is it's only really good up close. Well, I might as well try the air burst from here. I'm either going to get it or I'm not. A nice little prezi. That didn't do a lot. 
<laughs> it zoomed in on his frightened face. Oh, he's having a nap. Alright, gotta find the most effective way across this river without killing myself. That's the narrowest part. Probably there, actually. Not bad, not bad. Still enough health. And he hasn't got any... <coughs> he hasn't... Alright. Landmine. I don't think the landmines are going to trigger, but... Nope. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Colonel. I'll remember those words. I'm gonna sh try shooting the shelter with a shotgun. Maximum force. That went. How did that go over it? Well, we can all just try relentlessly shooting the thing with shotguns until it blows up. Oh my god. Holy shit! Damage, Captain. Whoa! What the fuck? What happened? <laughs> well, it looks like every single thing blew up at once. Wow. Okay, that went right. I was not expecting that. Okay, well, we don't have to promote him. Two, four, six, eight. Now we've got an entire team of engineers. That's a lot of TNT. All right, next mission. Let's go. Engineers are handy for minefields, wouldn't you know it? Hard, the hardest part of this level is literally just trying to figure a way out of the... Oh, hello there. Yep. Oh. May have to sacrifice myself a bit here. That wasn't bad. That was alright. And the best thing is, everyone else will be able to get out now. Does that really reach that range? Holy shit, it does. Fuck. <laughs> oh, we landed directly in the minefield. How sad. How tragic. What's he doing? I oh, not poison gas. You. Oh, everyone fucking hates poison gas. So, of course, he lands it. Oh, man. If that went all the way around and got his own guy, that would be amazing. Looks like we're definitely going to probably lose Spanky in this one because he's not going to get another go before he's killed. We've got no healer, which means can't really heal him. Alright, so where's this guy? He was like over here somewhere. He threw it from quite a way away. There he is. Well, hello there. Really gonna have to run. Oh, I'm not gonna make this. Oh, shit. No, I didn't make it, now I'm standing right next to him. I have no confidence in my abilities, sir. Luckily, that's not a lot of damage, regardless. I'm just gonna shotgun him off the edge. I think that's the best thing to do. <laughs> best thing to do. If we see any more boxes, we'll go for them. But I'm just gonna shoot. I'm just gonna shotgun the guy off the edge, because the shotgun's got quite a kick, and it'll push him straight into the minefield. Cut that, can it? Oh come on! Really? It didn't even move him? Are you joking? Well, we've still got punch, I guess. If all else fails. I still can't believe that shotgun blast moved him, like, a centimetre backwards. Still, he's very close to the edge, so this should just be- just punch him straight off. Oh. Bye. <laughs> right, well, Spanky's gonna have to go back inside, because I want that fucking bonus. I'm gonna have to pick up those health kits. There we go. Shouldn't be hurt anymore now. That's better, yeah. Don't think shrapnel grenades are very good. 
super air burst. Well, bye. Uh oh. The hell's he shooting at? Time to die, citizen. Oh. Ready, willing, and able, sir. Well, by revealing your position, you have thoroughly fucked up. And now you will face the wrath of me. My wrath. I must say, you are astoundingly close to a minefield down there. It was really unfortunate, this positioning. Oh, well, have fun. Tally ho. And all that. Come on, into the minefield. Into the minefield. Yeah, oh, yes. Look at that. <laughs> Directly in there. I will snap you like a stalk. Jesus Christ, these sniper rifles. Fucking hell. Happy me. Hello? Right, well, unfortunately, he's uh, left himself wide open to yet another unfortunate push into the minefield. No, no, no! Oh my fucking god, that was close. God damn it, it's like fucking Dark Souls with the sliding off of things. I don't think this is- this might work too well. <laughs> Blown him over it. <laughs> Shit. He's inside, idiot. Taste my mighty weapon. The hell? <laughs> What's this guy doing? We got some real amateurs on their stuff. Well, it's a bad day to be you, but a good day to be me. And that's the way the cookie crumbles. Bye. Oh, into the minefield. Look at that. 100% survival rate once again. Too easy. Well, hello. Looks like you're in the wrong place. Here, have that. Rest in the pepperoni. Into the water. Oh, right into the water. Really, you're gonna throw that at a tree? There's a tree there. There's a tree there. What the fuck is this guy doing? <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Next level tactics just fucking f absolutely wrecked by a tree. Oh, he's in the water. Oh, is he gonna make it out? Oh, he didn't make it out. So sad. Good work, Shelter. Once again, kicking ass for the team. Really? He's gonna go for a mortar sh- Oh, he's gonna go for the rest of the team. Normally the bombardiers are pretty good shots, so he should be able to hit him from there. Yep. Alright, well, let's fuck him up. I like Super TNT is just yellow and purple striped. Extra danger! Come on! Oh, and he's out. We can use a machine gun on the shelf. The shelf is going to oh, blow up. I should be a gun. What shall I do? Well, these guys are history. These guys are going to be out the next time I have a go. Let's throw a grenade. You could have thrown a grenade at the two that are actually like oh, on death's this. door. Why throw a grenade at that guy? He's got a health of 60. Even if you hit him, he's still got most of his health to go. Hey ho, diddly do. I agree. Hey ho, diddly do. I'm just gonna fuck him over. It's like it's like 30 to kill him or whatever. No, 50 30 to kill him, but I'm gonna do 50 because fucking you gotta go hard sometimes. Oh, that hit the other guy. That was good. Actually managed to do three lots of damage and kill two pigs in one go. Pretty impressive, if I do say so myself. Oh, I reckon he's going to kill one of them. Has he got the sniper rifle? <laughs> I 
<laughs> well, I thought he had some really elaborate evil plan, but it was just like, come down to the beach and pretend you're a tree. Like, that was, that was it. Right. Well, sorry to say, but that guy's probably going to be history. Nah, I'm joking, I'm not sad. Right, and then we'll just stick it under this very inconspicuous tree. <laughs> like, he moved into a position where I'd be able to tell which one it is. <laughs> All right, so now it's five engineers versus literally one scout. He's clearly got a plan. Is he going to hide behind the other trees? Yep. <laughs> He's turning him, turn him back into a tree, the sick bastard. All right, so he's this one. I don't know how much damage he ends up taking every time I put a stick of dynamite underneath him, but... The good thing is, this time, I get two goes, so I can put, I can put a landmine there, and then I can put a stick of dynamite, which means, like, one will blow up the defenses of the tree, and then the other one will, like, hurt him. <laughs> there you go, look at that. Flawless. Oh, he's still alive, though, shit. What a resilient guy. With the health of one. <laughs> Oh, uh, look out! This guy's gonna. Oh, he's going for his. Oh, he's going for a last ditch effort. Fighting is for fighting with no. He's a cornered man. He could take us all. <laughs> would that be me? Hello. I reckon if I farted in this guy's direction, he would probably die. So uh, <laughs> we'll uh, we'll go over there and I think I'll just punch him into the water. Who cares? Farewell, sweet prince. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe that. They just decided to turn into a tree both times because he thought somehow that would help. Yeah, this one's a pain in the ass. Mostly because there's a lot of spies in this level. But it is called the spying game, so I don't know what you'd expect. So they very cleverly marked the ground where these guys are going to land, so I'm literally just going to put TNT and <laughs> stick, a, stick a thing there where when this guy eventually, like, turns up. The hardest part is getting all your pigs through the water. Because we all start on this pitiful little island. Alright, well, it's super shotgun time, baby. Now, this really should push him quite a distance. So, I've just got to line this up. Oh. No! Oh, come on, I pushed X! Oh, fuck's sake. You should go back into hiding. I think, I think go back into hiding is the best possible thing that you can... Nope, he's going for poison gas. Of course, he's an asshole. You crave my shot, no? Miss, miss, miss. Ah, uh, they never fucking miss with a poison. Apart from that guy who was unfortunately foiled by a tree. They never miss with poison gas. Nice jump. Oh, another nice jump. Third nice jump. Nope, didn't even jump that time at all. Well, I don't even know what I can do with this guy now. But I know that there's another guy over here, so we'll just, like... There you are. I'm gonna have to just go for that, yeah. Well, that's the best I can do. Oh, we landed in the water. Nah, it wasn't enough water for him to really get hurt by it, though. Oh, this is not looking good. Oh, this is looking very bad. Well, the good thing is now that he's a bit further away, so I'm gonna... Stick some of this stuff underneath him. I'm just gonna jump over and fucking blow this guy to pieces. Sometimes it's, uh, it's just worth it, you know? <laughs> bye bye!
You try to hit me? Oh, he didn't make it. Tragic. Into the safety of the bunker. <laughs> oh my god, I am just... Oh, look at that. Oh, he made it. He made it, though. I wasn't even trying to get him in the water, and I got him in the water. Oh, re oh subtle. Subtle. <laughs> Rocket launcher. Now, the problem is, I have no idea where he is now. Might as well just wait. I might as well just wait out this go. Not much I can do, anyway. Don't know where he is. Right, there he is. Now he's come straight back into hiding. He's like, nope. Right, he'll be, obviously he'll be the one nearest to the water. In which case, it's definitely this one. Right. We may not even need... If, I, if this kills him, we may not even need all those landmines I placed on the spy posts. I have no <laughs> wish to die. Yeah, it hasn't said mission accomplished, so I'm guessing... Oh no, it has said mission accomplished. Fucking there you go. I think if you... I think if the mission goes on for long enough, then, like, spies drop in and you have to fight them too. But obviously we destroyed them well before then, because we're just that good. Just that good. Let's promote Bang. And call it a day. I will see you and the fuckers in the next video.